And as the flag said, we love you. Yeah. You can at least get a picture for her. Let's go. Katie, no iPod dinner. Go is the duck too salty? Tai <sighs> Kuema, three ninety nine a pound. I'm making one for Dad's retirement party. Oh, well, Mom, Mark and I have a benefit to go. Bring to him Saturday. afterwards. You never okay. visit anymore. Yeling just sent her daughter's wedding DVD. Her daughter's two years younger than Julie. She has John converting all their old videos to DVDs. She say VHS only lasts 15 to 20 years. You should get out more. I do. I I, I still go to ballroom. I mean, some place where you'll meet. People. Like Mark? Yeah. Uncle Tianping so devoted to Ame, every Saturday he go to tango with her. They're going to dance in the festival next month. Katie, you should do the ribbon dance. Mom, I'm really busy. Last time before college. Who is it? No one. It's work. Your fancy wedding planner, Karen? I left her three messages yesterday. It's Corinne, Mom. She chose white flowers. White. Is this a wedding or a funeral? Here. Look at these fabrics. Mom, I've already told you there's a dress being made in New York. Red is your color. So, Dad, are you looking forward to some rest and relaxation? I wish I could retire. Retire? You're about to get a promotion. Do you want to retire at 29? I'll be 30 next month. Oh, that's old. Katie. Thanks, Kat. What? It is. There's a Star Trek episode. A whole planet of people would honorably kill themselves on their 30th birthday. Katie. It was 60. Whatever. Well, Dad's 60 now and he still has a lot of life in him yet, right, Dad? Ed, the kids are talking to you. Stop pretending to be deaf. Ed! Lucky Pete on the rug. He's just getting old. Lucky your dog. You know, your father is always picking on the dog, but he's really picking on me. Why'd you pee on the rug, Mom? <laughs> it's a taxi. Really? Mm. Hey, what about the cake? Oh, okay. Happy birthday, Daddy. Well, open it. Since Lucky ate your last pair. Thank you. Three months. Prepaid weekly sessions with Dr. Levy. He's the best psychiatrist in the area. Oh, oh hey, hey, Sam! Why can't you be more careful? I'm sorry. I'll get you another one in Chinatown. Not so easy to replace. They're everywhere. Go and look after the family. Oh, yes. It's not going to give you bad luck, Mom. Okay. I'm really sorry, but we have to go. Come on, Jules. Happy birthday, Dad. Hello. Uh, well, he didn't seem happy for the cake. the 9.30. We're gonna grab a drink and catch the 11. I know. Next time we'll drive. I'll be fine. I love you too. So we finally got fitted for the dresses. <laughs> Katie hates them. Mark chose them. He's really picky. Obviously. <laughs> oh my god, is that Alex? You want this, so I want this. It's dreaming of being paid the dream you want is car. You want this. It's really good. <laughs> yeah. Mom says he teaches at the high school now. <laughs> really? <laughs> Do you need your inhaler? <laughs> Only a 
Are you gonna say hi? Uh, no, I don't think so. Should we leave? No, I'm fine. Let's just, you know, we'll finish our drinks and then we'll go. Actually, you know, we should get to the station now. For the world you live in, send a check when people are starving. In the comfort of your own hypocrisy, I'm not to blame if they don't see me. I'm part of the masses, I'm not guilty. I'm not guilty. I'm not guilty. Listen, can you do me a big favor? Can you drop it by to me tonight? Hey, I know. I'd like to before tomorrow. Just one more time.
time for lunch, Dad. This ends today's lecture. I provided the salient points on a handout. If there are any questions, do not hesitate to call me. Surgery later, you should come by and oh watch. Oh my gosh, really? You oh yeah, die. Yeah. What a good yeah. amazing. Is, is it okay if I watch? Oh, of course, no problem. Oh my god, I think that would be We'd love amazing. to have you there, Mia. Because I really no, just want to dig deep into this character. Oh, sure. Where's everyone? Oh, you don't know. Mm -mm. Mia Scarlet is here. Who's Mia Scarlet? Mia Scarlet is Mia Scarlet. You know, Dark and Stormy. That new show with Vixen. She's playing a surgeon in her new movie, so she's researching. Right. Could you do me a huge favor? Could you um just answer the phones? Um, for, no, for like actually, can five minutes? What? You be. Okay. Chest being opened. Here, drink this. Doctor's orders. Well, med student's orders. Well, at least the cameras weren't rolling. Your vomit was very convincing. <laughs> oh. This is so embarrassing. It's totally understandable. I called a car to take you home. Thank you. You're, you're welcome. Sorry. It's okay. Check out the little supernova, swooping over you when you're a hundred with a bit of sun and two cents have been to drop again to hold So to recap, we've used the oxidation number method to balance this net ionic redox equation for the reaction between the perchlorate ion and the bromide ion in acid solution. Okay. Please open your books to pages 316 and 317 and do the even number problem. And yes, that's hydrobiology. I check myself in the drawers a couple times for the calls before you Busters of the wackness in the battle, you know. That cloud is a rock. We're running underground, no go chain gang. Hanging off, banging now, you're too crazy, you Hey. Uh. Do you know, Katie, uh. It, it, it's totally natural to be curious about stuff like this at your age, and, um. What's most important is that you feel comfortable and, and safe. Uh, as you explore all, all your options. Um, I'm gonna give you something to read. 
on your own. And uh, you know, that, that door right there is always open. You can always come in and talk or just hang out or, you know, rap. So, yeah. Okay? Come on. When the collar comes within eight feet of the underground electrical perimeter, it'll sound a warning beep to alert the dog. See? There's the beep. I didn't hear the beep. See, there's the beep. Now, with the dog... I didn't hear it. Well, it's just important that the dog hears the beep. Believe me, he'll catch on quick. Continue the training regimen, and you can remove the flags gradually over the next few weeks. Can you hear anything? You mean the beep? You hear the beep? Yeah. Is this for Lucky? Um, well, I actually play a heart surgeon, and um, I lose a patient on the operating table. Oh. Yeah. Then I decide to go to Kenya and start an orphanage for refugee children. Oh, that's so yeah. nice. That's great. Wow. It's a really challenging yeah. story. Yeah. I can't wait to see it, though, because I love you. you and Dr. Oh, Starman. Oh, thank you so much. Oh. You get oh. great in this. Oh. Thank you very much. Oh, my God. And By the way, the I mean, I've always wanted to do acting. Fun. I didn't know if it's oh, acting. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, you should rap. The pony started hard, he got it rock, body rockin', baby Bobby, top, he had to kill a litter, but the problem is you got me sloppily, but got me not, you need a proper cup of coffee from my car for coffee pot, pot, piping, hot, and body, cold, slatty, or my poppy, not, I am not a swagger, more like bag of roller, dragon, not, tag along and back of me, I'm Hot or body cold, slightly more more probably not. I am not a swagger, more like bag of roller jagged not. Tag along and back of me, I'm planning, prepping, or I'm walking semi-automatic, all the pillar out of breath. Talk about it, brother, riding out of Simon, is that you? Yes, it's me. Oh, Simon, are you there? in your coat. It's not mine. Sam? Hey, Dad. Why didn't you go see Dr. Levy on Wednesday? I just heard from their office that you missed your appointment. Sam, I don't... I don't need it. Get him... Get him to get you a refund. I can't. Fine. Okay. Great. Oh, I've got another call. I'll talk to you later. Bye, Dad. Bye. Bye.
Dr. Levy, I'm sorry. There's been a mistake. There always is. I don't need therapy. My daughter bought me sessions as a retirement gift. I'd like to have a refund. Well, of course. Why don't you sit down and tell me about it? I don't need therapy. Would you like to talk about it? I want a refund. Okay. I'll make you a deal. If you can convince me you don't need therapy, I'll, I'll give you a refund. And uh, you've attempted suicide how many times? Maybe 30, 40 times. And uh, what happened? I'm always interrupted. You know, someone once said suicide is a permanent solution to a temporary problem. Do you find your life to be a temporary problem, Ed? You can keep that. What about the refund? Even Katie's gonna fly off in a few months. retirement. Here is two pension plans and the time with the family. Ed? <laughs> hey, Ed? Come
puasa. Mom, what are you doing? Try it on. Mom. I use Katie as a model. I can't believe you. Blind as a bee now, so stitch you know, not perfect. I already... See how it fits. Oh, probably a little loose here. Mom. This is really nice. This is really your color. Mom. You can wear it at the reception. It won't match the flowers. Then change the flowers. You know, you shouldn't use that so much. I read it makes your heart beat too fast. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I'm gonna go drop the cat off. How's your um hip hop step dancing team thing? We perform in two weeks. Oh, that's exciting. It's on a Saturday. Oh. Mm. Got to meet with my client then. I wish I could make it. It's fine. you back here? Um, when Mr. Winters died, um, they didn't have a replacement, so I decided I'm going to rescue these poor kids. What? I'm impressed. You're still playing. Does that really surprise you? Not. You know, I play every Tuesday night in the city at Purelli's. In New York? Yeah. You should come by next week. Okay. I better get back. To I my should studies. let you go. <laughs> it's good to see you, Sam.
silk, you're my cashmere, you're my gloves in the winter. Everything keeps me warm. Coming in. Got some great acts inside. I know. <laughs> I thought you were meeting Liz tonight. I would have made more. It's okay. She had to reschedule. Hmm. Actually, I'm not really that hungry. Hmm. Here, I'll have it. Mm. Okay, what about Thursday? Corinne's coming over. We're putting the finishing touches on the veil. Mm. Friday? It's the Yale alumni dinner. Oh, do we have to go to that? Well, that puts us in the next week. Okay, uh, let's do a Tuesday. Um, I might be busy Tuesday. Doing what? Um, I don't know. Actually, Tuesday's fine. Okay. Tuesday it is. I'll take care of the tickets. It'll be fun. And I could totally use this for my article. Oh, yeah, it's very interesting. Yeah. Can I get a copy of that? Oh, yeah, of course, of course. Thank you very much. Yeah. Put it in my box. Good morning. Hey, Mia. Hello. I believe I owe you a drink. Say, tonight, 8.30? Um, oh, okay. Great. I'll come find you. See you later. Wow. So while no one was hurt, this is a very serious offense. We, we do take this thing very seriously. Um, now, because it was Katie's first offense, the administration is not going to be pressing any charges. However, you know, this kind of thing doesn't look good to Princeton. And I, I know that your parents are, are on vacation in Zimbabwe right now and that your popo is deaf. Uh, but I, I am going to have to talk to them when they come back next month. Sorry, I tried to call Jules, but she was in the OR. So probably, I had to think of something. Do you want me to tell him to stop? No. Then you've got to stop this. He loves me.
Thanks, Sam. Katie got herself involved. Yeah, I heard, quite yeah. A, yeah. Literally, it was right down my hallway. I'm sorry I couldn't make your show. Oh, it's okay. I'm there every week. I'll so come by next. Yeah. Sorry. That'd be great. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um. So how's your dad? You know my father. Uh, I'll never forget that time when we sang karaoke. He doesn't sing so much anymore. Oh, that's too bad. Come back to one of my classes. <laughs> mm. Why did he stop? I don't know. I think he got tired. I guess when you get old. Congratulations. Oh. Thanks. Yeah. Looks like you got your fairy tale. I'm happy for you, Sam. I gotta get back, but I'll see you soon. You take care, Sam. What can I get you? Um, two Valencias, please. Oh, what's in that? You coat the inside of a martini glass with fino sherry, uh, flame a few orange peels, use chilled gin, and strain. You bartend? Sometimes. Then why don't you try it? <laughs> I've never had a Valencia. It was invented in the 1930s by a bartender at Chasen's in Beverly Hills. It's also called a flame of love. <laughs> because Frank Sinatra had one and fell in love. And then he threw a party at Chasen's and ordered 200 of them. It's a lot of love. And it's a lot of oranges. <laughs> you know, I couldn't peel an orange or a corn apple until I was in college. My mother always washed and cut everything for us with these little toothpicks. The first time I tried to peel a potato, I almost lost half my finger. <laughs> well, now you slice and dice people with the best of them. Well, after carving a watermelon, heart transplants are nothing. You're Valencia, doctor. White Russian. Watch it. One sip and you are hooked for life. Mmm. This is my favorite. I learned that one in college. <laughs> A long parade of goddesses pass through my bedroom door. I unhook gowns and bodices. Till it became a chore I dined with Julie London once And charmed her with my wit Joe, I could use another hit <laughs> It's okay, I'll, I'll grab the next one Thanks for the drinks Anytime. Uh. Hello? Oh. Hi, Dad. Uh, hold on a sec. Really? Dad? It's okay. I'll, I'll see you at the hospital. Uh, How is your presentation going? If you need any more articles on Dad, I'm actually oh. out right now. Ask her how the date went with the nice Stanford doctor. Well, your mother wanted to ask you. How did they Can we talk about this some other time? 
What did you say? What? Dad, Dad, I'm losing you. I'm losing you. I'll Hello? Call you tomorrow, okay? Julie, what did you say? Julie. Juilliard, didn't you? Almost. My parents didn't think it was such a good idea. Maybe they were right. They were. It just didn't feel right at the time. When I was 12, I wanted to be a fireman. And then you grow up. And look how great things turned out for me. He's crazy. We have to find him. I'm sure he's fine. He'll be back when he's hungry.
You got him another pair. Lucky. <laughs> I'm gonna stay until we find Dad. What about your presentation? What about Mom and Dad? <sighs> Honestly, it's probably for the best. Why are you always so unromantic? Romantic? About Mom and Dad? Come on, Jules. You know it's not about being flushed and tongue-tied and... <sighs> that lasts for like half a second. It's about shared history and experiences and, you know, they've spent 30 years together. That's something. So why did he leave? I don't know. Yes, we checked his office already. Well, please let us know if you hear anything. She's she Ma, Ma, I've called everyone. I really think we should go to the police. Good morning. What are you still doing here? Crazy old man. Hurry up, Katie. That's all. School's in 15 minutes. The jazza are still fresh. He just has to heat them up. Come on, Katie. Bye, Katie. Bye, Katie. Bye, guys. What about your office? You know, you should head back to the city and prepare for your talk.
here at the Great Buddha Hall. It houses the largest Buddha in the Americas. It was built in 1985, and we're going to be going upstairs. You know where all great philosophers end up? Oh. You mean here? Nobody lives forever. So you want to give it another try? It doesn't matter. Children grow up. Parents die. It's better just to leave it alone. Are you sure you don't want to lift home? It's better I'm here. That's from Mom and uh, and Julie and actually Katie and um, this is some extra footage you might have missed. So in answer to your question, I think the real frontier in oncology lies in biologics, like the EGFRs we looked at today. I think that's my time. Any more questions? No. no. Well, thank you, Julie. Great presentation. Nice job. Nice job. Good job. Good job. Hey. So, how to go? Really well. You know, I think I might go into oncology. Huh. It's actually a very exciting time in the field. Yeah. I really think that chemotherapy will become a thing of the past. Yeah, okay. yeah you know, my dad... Hey. So he just ran away? To a monastery. Is he coming back? I don't know. 
But you know what? There's nothing I can do about it. Oh my god. <laughs> I must have it. Oh, come on. Mia, um... Come on, I need your help. I, I can't believe I'm doing this. Oh! <laughs> what are you gonna do with this? I haven't really thought about that. <laughs> I can help you carry it home. Mine or yours? Congratulations on your promotion. Oh my gosh. Yeah, everyone gather around with a little toast for Sam. Cheers. Sam. Our promotion Sam. And for the wonderful job she's done. Thank you. Congratulations. 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 Cheers. Cheers. All right. The dance connects two people more closely than the Argentine tango. Standard dance position. The man always leaves, but the woman must offer resistance. Oh, frame. Perfecto. Musica. Dodge me forever. I can try. You leave us alone. Oh, oh, feisty. Who's the lovely lady? Nobody, George, okay? She's just a friend. Friend my ass. Back so off. you say your name's Julie. All right, okay, you know what? I'll do it. Hold on one sec. 
quick, George. All right. So what would you like to know? Why don't you tell me a little bit about Julie? <laughs> Come on, she's not my type. Besides, I keep all my uh, pets leashed up at home. <laughs> that's not what Angelina tells me. Oh, really? Well, that's because uh, Angie and I have what you might call a special relationship. Oh, special? Why don't you tell me a little bit about that? <laughs> I don't think so. I think you uh, have the pictures to prove it, don't you? Do we? Of course, we should seat my mom as far away from dad as possible. And did we even remember to invite my stepmother? Sam. Sam. Hmm? Oh, which one? Susan? No, Gwen. Oh, I think we did. Gwen. Why don't you just seat her with my parents? I mean, I don't even know if my father's going to be there, so. All right. Hmm. I'm going to change the whole thing. Hmm. Mark, it's been a really long day. Can we do this later? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know it's been really rough for you, but it's not your fault that your father's crazy. Mark, my dad's not crazy. He's just confused. Of course he is. Everyone goes through a crisis when they retire, honey. He's finally had the time to slow down, and maybe he's... Maybe he's just not happy with where People he is. People are always unhappy with where they end up. <laughs> Even monks. Actually, you know, I've been thinking about taking some time off myself. Great. While you're thinking, Let's try to finish this seating chart, okay? Mark, I've changed my mind. I don't want white flowers. I want red lilies. Or camellias. Honey, I mean, there's a reason that we pay Corinne. I know. I just... My mother... Sam, I know you're stressed, but trust me. It'll all be beautiful and, and fashionable and, and perfect. Mark, I don't want a fashionable wedding. Okay. Can you just... Let's talk about this in the morning. Mark, can you just listen to me for a second? I don't need exotic flowers flown in from Thailand. I don't need thousand-dollar napkin holders or, or a... a, a Guest list that reads like a Liz Smith column. Tim, I don't understand what's going on. All I need... All I need is... Mark. Are you happy? What? Do you think we're ready? Yes, Sam, we're ready. Everything is all set. The, the invitations, the flowers, everything, except for this damn seating chart. And me. I'm not ready. Feed us up. I can't walk without shoes. I've made up my mind, I'm going away, away home. I'm a fool. I wish there were something more to say. Hey, 
Junie, wait. Julie, will you just listen to me for a second? I'm really busy. Well, I filled up your voicemail. You can't give me one minute. I've got a meeting uptown. Shh. They're trying to study. Okay, fine. Let's talk tonight. I'm on call. Till when? 4 a.m. Julie, look, I don't care who you are. You can't treat people. You can't treat I know me. what you're thinking. It's... No, you don't. Just let me explain. Leave me alone. Julie, I was trying to protect you. Believe me, you Do don't want... Do you know want... what, Mia? Save it for your fans. What are you doing here? Look, before you throw me out, please, please just let me explain. That reporter has been stalking me for months. He's, they're just, I was just trying to keep them away from you. Because you're ashamed of me? Julie, this is really important to me. You're so different from everybody. And I just wanted to keep you to myself a little longer. I know I handled it badly. Yeah, you did. And maybe I'm not glamorous or exciting or famous, but I don't deserve to be treated like that. And I'm definitely not interested in being one of your pets. Well, I just, um, I just wanted you to know that I'm sorry. What is that? It's, it's Gouda. <clears throat> it's cheese. <laughs> I know what Gouda is, but why do you have a bag of it? I went to the bodega around the corner to, um, to get you some flowers, but they were out. And <laughs> everything else is closed, so... So, so you got me Gouda? That's all they had. <laughs> it's, it's all flavors. Um, mild and, um, and sharp and jalapeno. I'm sorry. Hi. 
me and you know that a two bell battle just begun. And if you hit the gravel, there I am holding the fort down. Bring what you got, I stand directly on the spot. It's the rock for my fly, I'm ready to take off. Give me that, cause it's combat. Shining in a bitch black, I'm never letting up until my last breath. Oh no, shit. I'm late. What's the matter? Hey, Jules, it's me. I ended up driving home last night. Long story. Anyway. I hope you don't mind taking the train. Oh, and don't forget about the show. I've got to call Sam. No, it's okay. I'll drive you. Katie's show starts in 15 minutes. You're right. We'll never make it. I've been around makes in a fall from a rookie. I'm a vet to the claw, baby. Yes, I'm fast. I keep a bill full, just stuff for cash. But it's not about money, it's about who lasts. Taking a chance out back, wanting to dance. I don't throw them things like Dr. Strange. I'm a grown man, dog. That's the younger phase. I'm all about vocab and a good exchange. Change your lanes, traffic jams. With words that can turn to a fisherman. While your fisher price in a box made of plastic. Turn the page, dog. I'm past it. Stretch like elastic. Plastic balls, what I'm asking. If you can't bring it, then it's tragic. Whoa. El Pro got something for all of y'all to hear. When I say let's move through the atmosphere, take off. Countdown, three, two, one. Rock to the rhythm, can be out done. When I take what I make, all the tech formulate. And you know we get back to one. Uh, and you know we get back to one. Yeah. And you know we. The rhythm. that one back too. So you want to keep it? Not right now. But thanks anyway. You should have kept the ring. Ma. Maybe you just postpone, not cancel. We can do it next year. Plenty of time to do it now next year. Ma. Give woman, Jian Khan, Quila. 
好，吃吧。哎 ，Julie， give her some of the duck.、Oh. Simon, the noodles very good for your eye. Have some.、Oh, Maybe the duck smells delicious. Very simple dish. It's Julie's favorite. So Mia, you work at the hospital also? <laughs> well, yes. I guess you could say that.、Um, actually, I'm an actress, and、uh, Julie's helping me prepare for a role. Oh, well, that's nice. What kind of movies do you make? Oh, well, Selena's Secret is my favorite. No, you you were the best in Dark and Stormy. Oh, thank you. Well, what about that one with the lesbian detective? Oh, oh, my, oh god. my god! I'm so sorry. Oh my, oh my god! I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Fine. I'll show you the phone. Here's a napkin. No, I got one. I have stain remover. Sorry, come on. You know I'll get you a new one. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'll get the stain remover. I can't believe we're eating with Mia Scarlet. Well, I can't believe she's with Julie. Shh.
Don't 